Whether your struggle is small or big, our struggles point to deeply fractured places in our soul. What if that struggle is about something much more? What if it's actually about believing an ultimate lie about yourself? That the truest part of you, the deepest part of you, is fatally flawed and deeply unworthy. Words like foolish and disobedient and deceived and enslaved become the plot in our stories even when we don't recognize it. Our God is a non-fault-finding God who wants to generously give us the very thing that I think we all need. Yet the struggle is real to find that place. We don't seem to quite be able to get there. You and I are both destined for a rewrite when we are in Christ. It means that the brokenness that we've experienced along the way, those chapters in your past where you've experienced hurt or shame, or you've acted out in ways that you know are never the person that you wanted to be, Jesus can actually go back there and make something new even out of that. If you're a child of God, if you love God, He is always available to you. Turn to Him and experience His mercy as you step into your new story. This is an invitation to God's reality. And this is an invitation to transparency within yourself. This is an invitation to a ruthless kind of honesty where you open yourself up to experience God's reality for your life to be perfectly honest about who you really are and to listen for the story he's writing about you. When Jesus enters the story, when Jesus enters the struggle, no matter how small or big they may be, everything changes.